All right, everybody, Steve and I have just left Mexico, Missouri about an hour ago. We're heading down to Seabrink, Florida for the uh, fly-in down there at Seabrink. Um, it starts on Wednesday. We're going to have a rudder workshop, a two, or a two session workshop for building the rudders on the Xena. Uh, we stopped, uh, we just took off from Farmington, Missouri. Had to get a little fuel because we're uh, encountering uh, pretty head, head, a lot of headwinds here. And we just didn't want to chance it to our next fuel stop uh, running low. So we're back in the air and uh, got Steve over here flying a little bit. Traffic helicopter 7098 November. Uh, crossing uh, midfield, right downwind. As you can see, there's snow on the ground. We got a little bit of snow yesterday again. Um, it's about okay. 10 degrees outside. Um, I have uh, 14 in the on the outside temperature. Uh, there's there's 16, 16 degrees. So it's pretty cold out today. We need to make some headway, get down where it's a little cooler, or a little warmer, a little warmer. <laughs> And we're in the 750 Super Duty. Hey, traffic helicopter, uh, 7090 November, midfield, left downwind, uh, 92, runway 20, Perryville traffic. And we've got the, the Evolution uh, unpaneled in our 750 Super Duty. It's working out very well. Got lots of visibility, lots of room. Oh, we'll catch back with you guys later when we get down our trip a little further down the road. Everybody, we're uh, on our second day trip, heading to uh, Seabrink, Florida, for the Sport, a U.S. Sport Air Show, and uh, we're just flying right over Woodhaven, yeah, Florida. Seven seven Sierra, seven miles to the uh, north east, inbound to one fourth, Tampa North. Winter Haven, Florida is just a, such a beautiful yeah, place. A beautiful place to to do a lot of float flying. So we're about uh, we're about uh, 32 minutes out of Seabring. We've been doing this for a day and a half. Had really actually pretty good weather today. We've had uh, some headwinds, about 20 to 30 knot headwinds. So it's been a little slower than usual, but we've had fun. Hey, hi, Steve. All right. And uh, we'll get there, and hopefully everything will be set up, and we don't have to do much for the rudder workshop, right? But hopefully not. Hopefully everybody's got it set up for us. Yeah, uh, so you got uh, Sebastian. He's already at the uh, Sebring Expo. And uh, he took the airlines down instead of flying, which uh, is not as much fun as flying. But uh, we had to make sure he, he got there because we are having a rudder workshop the next four days. And we've got uh, customers coming in, you know, counting on us. As you know, we're going flying, uh, uh, got time to spare, go by air. But uh, it's been a pretty good uh, show. I don't know what we got down here. Uh, those are manatees. Or what are those? Or what is that all down there? I don't know. No, that's not manatees because we're in a lake. I don't know what that is down there. Something. Oh, it's like a barrier. They have a, there's a, yeah, it's a little sh place to do shows and stuff. Yeah, the amusement park thing. It is a very interesting place to fly over just because of the housing is so much different than ours at home. A lot of these houses along the lake have all got private docks on them. And I find these lakes down here super interesting because they're all round. And they're just they're everywhere. Right. Yeah, just beautiful. I mean, uh, there's no shortage of cash down here, I'll tell you. Look at that house. And they're just not one of them. There's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds like that. Just beautiful. At this big lake we're flying over and nobody's fishing but this one lonely guy. We uh, landed uh, just north of here in... Uh, Wellington, Wellington, and uh, you know, is 
What was it? 60 degrees, 50 degrees? 54, I think. 54, and everybody's complaining how cold it was. Well, they don't know what cold is, but it is supposed to, they said by the end of the week, it's supposed to get the high, it's supposed to be only a 32 for there. All right, well, I'm going to let you guys go, and we're going to head into Sebring. We're about 30 minutes out. I'll see you guys there.